Those first responders continue to comb through the rubble in Florida. Fox 6's Ashley Sears spoke with a team of firefighters right here in Milwaukee that train for these nightmare scenarios. She joins us live downtown with a look at what goes into a rescue effort like this. Ash? Ben, more than 70 members of the Milwaukee Fire Department make up what is called the Heavy Urban Rescue or HURT team. Though these types of situations like the one in Florida are extremely rare, they're ready to help with them. Something we train for on a regular basis. It's a specialized unit within the Milwaukee Fire Department. And every day we preach safety. The heavy urban rescue team or HURT team is made up of more than 70 firefighters trained to help with everything from rope and trench rescue to structural collapses. Something like that seems to be extremely rare. Captain Brian Moore is part of the team. He says the devastation in Florida is not common, but it's a situation they could handle here in Milwaukee. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is keep the safety of ourselves and the civilians of the city of Milwaukee in mind. The team first works to stabilize the structure then uses specialized equipment. And we're able to stick it through into void spaces. Like cameras that can squeeze into small spots, searching for survivors. And then you are able to move the end of it to look around. A Delsar life detector acts as the ears of the rescue team. Each one of these pucks goes out and it sits on top of the structure that has collapsed. Listening for people hidden in the rubble. As long as they're knocking, talking or anything like that, this will pick up on that and it'll give us the ability to go in and find them. Though the tragedy in Florida is something no one ever wants to happen again, this team is ready to help if it does. It gives us a reminder of things to look for, things to think about when incidents like that happen. And responding to scenes like the one in Florida can take a big toll on rescue crews. Captain Moore says there are resources available for first responders to help with mental health needs. Reporting live downtown, Ashley Sears, Fox 6 News. It's a safety tip there, too. If you're caught in a collapse, make noise, bang on the walls. They can hear you from up above. All right, Ash, thanks.